coming up next weekend. There's something very important going on at the Bethlehem Center. This is called Art from the Heart. Only this year, it's a virtual event. Debbie Boggs is here, and Debbie is the development director for the Beth. First of all, Debbie Boggs, good morning. Good morning, Chip. How are you all doing? We are doing well and happy the weekend is here. You guys have only got a few days left to put the finishing touches on Art from the Heart. But I did want you to spend a few seconds telling us exactly what the Bethlehem Center is and what you're doing today. And it's hard to believe that the Bethlehem Center has been serving our community for 100 years. Wow. That First of is all, correct. Congratulations on a job well done. Tell me what you guys do at the Beth. Okay, sure. 100 years. So we're having a wonderful celebration despite all the crisis. We are coming out of it, thank God. And we have been around as a daycare, as a um, educational center. We have also started a Read to Lead Academy, which is both an after school mm -hmm. and summer program. We also have an adult program, and we are working with the seniors in the community, everything from faith to finances to a new market that we have started growing vegetables and fruits. I have so that seen, all our neighbors can have fresh fruit and vegetables. I have seen very few organizations, number one, that have been able to withstand the test of time like that. And the Bethlehem Center is such a widely encompassing community program. There's virtually no part of life that you guys don't touch and influence in some way for the better. So congratulations to you all on that. All right, Thank Art you. from the Heart. You've been doing this now for how long? This is our third year, Chip. Third year for Art from the Heart, and everything was going along just peachy, and then bam, here comes COVID, which obviously made you reformulate and rethink everything as it pertains to this event. So now you're taking it virtual. Explain to we me are. how this is going to work. Okay, we have got our art behind us. We are going to have everything up on the website, our Facebook Live page. Mm -hmm on YouTube. As of tomorrow, you are going to be able to go on and start bidding on silent auction items. And then next Thursday, the 17th at 730, we are going to be live at the Feedco. Mm -hmm. And we are going to actually have a live musician there, Baron Wilson. Carter Stein, our live auctioneer, is going to be presenting the art pieces. And we are going to have some success stories from the community. And our wonderful director, Reginald Smith, is going to talk to you a little bit about what we've been doing for 100 years. Wow. So next Thursday's the big night. All right, Art from the Heart. And we only have time to show you a couple of pieces here, but this is a series of three pieces. Tell us briefly, and again, we only have a minute or so left, about the artist who did these. Oh, wonderful. Jane Newman has worked with our students for many, many years, mm -hmm. teaching them various art techniques, and she has been on our board. She has served in so many capacities, but she is a wonderful artist in the community. And this that one, is called the SIP series. Th this one, the SIP series. This one right here is called 4 p.m., correct? Yes. Well, let yes, me start sir. on the other side. This is 7 a.m. <laughs> right here with the coffee cup. And over here we have 4 p.m. relaxing with a nice cup of tea. And then here we have 7 p.m. that I'll put right here in the center of these where she is obviously relaxing with a nice glass of wine. So, yes. um, well, and I love how these are framed and put together and these would fit pretty much any decor and we'll be able to bid on these live, correct? Yes, sir. And they will be sold either separately or as a set. Separately or as a set. Any rough idea how many pieces of art total you'll have? On the website, we're going to have at least 25, 30 pieces. Mm -hmm. And then in the live, we'll have three or four pieces of art. And then we've got a wonderful weekend getaway package. All right. Um, Debbie, we're going to have to cut you off there. But I will tell you this. If you have something you would like to contribute to Art from the Heart for the Beth, they'll make room for it. They'll be happy to accept your donation. Find out more by checking out the website, which is the Bethlehem Center. Check it out at the Beth.